Uh, welcome back, thrill seekers. This is still our basic Roden pulse motor with a MOSFET circuit. This here is my tiny magnetic hall switch derived, and this thing over here is my 16 volt 0.12 farad super cap. And at the moment, I've just been mucking about with the gen coils on this and. Yeah, quickly got it up to 10 volts. Um, I'm just trying to work out what to do with all this speed. Oh, I've been looking at and reading up on the Thanes Heinz high impedance, high impedance coils, uh, using as gen coils, and you know counteracting that uh, CMF or back EMF or whatever you want to call it. <coughs> um, Current draw on this to get to the speeds that I want, uh, which is quite fast. Uh, at the moment, it's at about 500 milliamp. I can get it down to about 300, still running pretty quickly. This here is my uh, high impedance coil. That's my Gen coil, and it's got um, it's got one of these crushed up inside as the, the core in it, that's that, um, uh, not move metal, what's the other one? Anyway, the stuff that, that splinters and gets into your fingers and it's like glass but it's metal. Um, no, no, crystalline metal. Anyway, maybe it is called move metal. Um, so I thought I'd just spin this up and see if anybody has any ideas of um, the amount of things that are around at the moment for uh, countering lens effect and those sorts of things. If anyone has any ideas what I can do with this particular rig, that'd be helpful. So I'll just spin this baby up. So I'll move this gen coil just off to the side so it's not influencing in any way. I'll fire this baby up. slow down. Current draw is still about the same. Move it back out. Get those ribs up again. Anyway, if anybody has any ideas, that'd be good. Must get some flexi to last for this thing. Bye. 